Cindy, can you share with us how Al-Anon helped you cope when your husband's drinking would upset your family's plans? Sure. It seemed like my family plans were often upset. I couldn't really count on being able to plan anything. We had tickets to a concert one night, and I came home, and he was drunk, and we couldn't go. And my old way of behavior was just to get upset, mm -hmm. um, feel bad, cry, be angry with him. Um, you know, sometimes it was hard to remember that alcoholism is a disease. Yeah. And it really wasn't his fault. It was just so easy to take it personally. So with Al-Anon, I learned not to just have a plan A, that it was also good to have a plan B or a plan C or maybe even a plan D. Mm -hmm. So if I had tickets to something, I could ask him to go, but I could have a backup. And people in Al-Anon understood. They understood what I was going through, and they understood that I couldn't really count on him to be able to go to things with me. Sure. And so um, I could call them last minute if he couldn't go. Um, sometimes I also learned to just do things on my own. Um, that was almost a way of a detachment for me. It would still get me out of the house. I could go to the event. And through al I learned not to be resentful for being there by myself. And by the time I got home, he was often in bed and I had a nice, quiet, serene house. So life was, it, it helped. Thank you for sharing with us, Cindy. You're welcome.